Despite the negativity surrounding the coronavirus pandemic, the Men Love Brothers are taking this opportunity to spread the love of LA sports to everyone. As the coronavirus continues to spread, families like the Robleses find joy in local food pantries. George Gascon leads in the polls for Los Angeles District Attorney. Fitness centers like the Row House stay open to serve their communities. Reporting from Granada Hills for Valley View News, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Packing bags is a daily November duty for Moore Park Pantry Plus volunteers. Mother of four, Deanna Robles, relies on the pantry during this tough time. For my babies, diapers, uh, wipes, food, and this hard time for me. Robles says she has been going to the food pantry since she was 11 years old. After her husband passed away, she has been coming more often. She says it's nice to know they are willing to help. Right now, I need a lot of things from my parents because my husband passed away. And Patty has a lot of things that I don't have. So right now, I'm not working, so that's why I come here. Frequent donor to Moore Park Pantry Plus, Charlie Keith, says he helps in order to give back to anyone who needs assistance. He says it's very important to him, especially during this pandemic. There's so many people that are hurting and they uh, really need uh, help. So that's uh, our way of trying to get them something to eat and make them feel a little bit better. As the coronavirus continues to spread, families like the Robleses find joy in local food pantries. Reporting from Moore Park for Valley View News, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Spray painting the lawns of strangers is unconventional work, but Monrovia teen Zachary Menlove and his younger brother Joshua turned it into a thriving COVID-19 business called LA Lawn Art. Yeah, we get there, we ask what logos they want, we put it on their lawn, straighten it up, and then spray it, and then we take it off, fill it in, and they just love it. The boys make their wooden stencil logos by hand. The majority of the orders are for LA sports teams, but they'll make stencils for any team. They are even willing to do stencils not associated with sports. I like doing sports a lot just because it's like helping people wrap their teams and stuff. But I, yeah, I will do Christmas and just other holidays. The brothers say they saved their money and donated to charitable organizations. In October, they donated to breast cancer research. Their father, Ryan Menlove, says he's proud to see them give so willingly. If they can learn to be giving and give back, uh, there's nothing more I could want for my boys to work hard and learn to be giving. Zachary says the best part of the business has been seeing their customers' reactions. I am beyond excited, to be honest. I don't want it to go away. I'm going to tell my gardener, don't touch my lawn for a while. And, and when it does, I probably will have them out here again. Despite the negativity surrounding the coronavirus pandemic, the Men Love Brothers are taking this opportunity to spread the love of LA sports to everyone. Reporting from Kavina for Valley View News, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Armenia and Azerbaijan are still involved in heavy fighting over Nagorno-Karabakh. Both sides accused each other of violating a new truce. The fighting started on September 27th. Rockets, drones, and heavy artillery are being used in battles, and hundreds of civilians and combatants have been killed. Armenia has made it clear that they don't want war. They say they only want peace.